Lauren, I'm an OT at CPA Ride. Constraint Induced Movement Therapy, also known as CIMT, aims to improve the functional upper limb movement in children with hemiplegic cerebral palsy. By improving the functional use of children's affected upper limb, it makes it easier for them to complete by manual activities when they're required to use two hands together. Neuroplasticity is the brain's ability to change and adapt. The way we create new pathways in the brain is by repeating tasks over and over. This is called motor learning theory. When tasks are specific and practiced repeatedly, the brain is able to learn what it needs to do to complete a task. This will eventually stick, allowing for the change to occur. The more this can happen or be practiced in a short period of time, the better. At first, most kids are a little hesitant to wear the slings. However, most of their fears and worries usually disappear within the first few minutes of starting the group. The kids tend to love the group setting and are able to meet other children who are the same as them, which is so encouraging.